So, this is my natural, untamed, no product, natural hair. Um, I'll give you guys a brief story. I just recently started getting like really serious about it. I stopped putting perms in my hair like when I was in high school simply because me and my mom, well, my mom used to do my hair all the time and we just looked and my hair kind of became trained to getting flat ironed. So I kind of was like, you know, there's no point putting perms in my hair anymore. So I stopped. So I guess that was the first step. But I still put color in my hair. I would still flat iron my hair and do all types of different styles and heat and you know constantly continuously putting heat in my hair so I wasn't all the way natural but I stopped putting perms and chemicals in my hair um also don't mind my eyebrows I haven't did anything to my face I literally just got out of the shower and was like hey I'm gonna record this yeah so I used to always put I um, mean yeah, hella products hella heat in my hair and stuff cut it trimmed it not trim but cut it layer it and all types of different style but it would always come back to some type of curl pattern um so that was in high school college i was still like so into like wraps and sh super straight hair um so right in college let's see i decided to join the air force and um I guess you could say I pretty much went natural in boot camp because, well, we didn't have anything else to do with our hair but put it back in a bun. So my hair actually did pretty good. So, um, yeah. So in basic, I used to put hella products in my hair then too. So um, still wasn't all the way natural. So then um, came out of basic and then I met the love of my life and then I got pregnant. Your hair can get super duper strong, super thick, and just long, and that's what mine said. And I pretty much wore my hair natural my whole entire pregnancy. I think I only straightened it for my baby shower. And then um, after I had my beautiful son, um, I decided I wanted to be sexy, <laughs> so I cut my hair. Why did I cut my hair? I don't know. In my head, being sexy consisted of me having short hair. And it was really sexy, but um, I didn't have to cut my hair to be sexy. I don't know. It was just a phase I was going through. So I ended up cutting my hair. And I loved it for like a hot split season. And then when it got cool outside, I was like, bro, I want to put my hair in a bun. But I can't because I ain't got no hair. <laughs> Bye. So when I went through all of that, oh, hey. Uh, me and my husband and our family had to move to Japan. So we're over here across the world in this Asian country who knows nothing about natural hair. And I'm here with short with a shortcut. And I barely know anything about taking care of natural hair myself. So I'm over here stranded with short hair. Ugh, I went through so many phases. So ugh, texturizer because I thought tight coarse curls were just not it so I got a texturizer because I didn't like it I know it was stupid but I got it and it completely fucked up my whole excuse me it completely messed up my whole entire hair texture so once again I did not like the texture of my hair so we went back home to visit and I got my homegirl Keisha to cut my hair in this sexy bob um not bob but bowl cut and it was red I had her dye it red and it was beautiful my hair was still natural and I had to come back to Japan and I also forgot again that hey nobody here knows how to take care of short color damaged hair and of course I got tired of that hair color so I colored my hair again so I went from red to black two strong ass colors completely damaged my hair my hair grew but it was damaged so I didn't want to straighten it anymore I decided to do six months of non-stop protective styling and in between each protective style I did treatments hot oil treatments deep conditioning treatments masks all that and just not no heat no nothing on my hair and here I am today and my hair I'm 
completely happy with my hair. You know, like, you know, take care of your hair. This is all you got. Yeah, that's pretty much my hair journey. This is the style I ended up doing. And I ended up using just my Eco Styling Gel on my curls. And it kind of manipulated some of them because they just didn't want to act right. But for the most part, just pretty much use my Eco Styling Gel and my Y2 Comb and just kind of comb through them. And manipulated a few of them. But for the most part, this is all your girl here. And um, I just kind of use my blow dryer on low, cool, and it kind of, you know, to dry my scalp because I was going to be walking around and it's kind of chilly here. So, um, yeah, that's it. So, um, I'm going to keep you guys posted on some videos and some protective styles that I tried to do on my hair. Um, you guys let me know what you all think. Let me know what y'all want to see. And um, I'll keep you guys posted. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see y'all later.